Good evening, guys. How's it going? John Bonham here, Cape Cod Wet Shaving. I'm back, officially. Been a rough couple of weeks uh, between Mary's passing. It's been a week since I did that Ode to Mary video. Um, kids got out of school a couple days after that. So between what's been going on and the kids out, it's been crazy. Jess's first day back to work was today. And um, I'm doing my... Uh, shave of the day at night so usually what I do is I'll um, do the video then post the shave of the day then post the video after I edit it kind of I barely edit it really I just piece things together tonight I did the shave of the day a couple hours ago and then decided to do the video after using what I had posted and the reason for that is because I really wanted to get this out there I might be the first person doing a shave video with it, but it's uh, Burn the Ships by Hoffman's Shave and Soap Co. I got this on uh, pre-order. I got it early. Um, I'm not sure when it's coming out. I think it got pushed back a week. It was supposed to come out the 28th today, the 20th, or yesterday. That's where I am. Whatever day today is the 28th, I believe it was. Um, but I will be using that along with the splash I got. There was an EDP. I didn't get that. I don't usually get the EDPs. I am excited about this. I'm going to be using American Shave Co. Uh, Pre-Shave Oil. And Post-Shave Balm will be Kenneth Cole Black. I'm going to be using my... Uh, oh, i drawing a blank. It's been a long day. Frank Shaving Brush. Uh, Red Crackle is what I call it. I think that's what it's called. I'm going to be using my Shave It Shave Co. Shadow Monster. Again, I love this razor, so I'm always in the mood to use that. And I'll be using Parker Blades with that. So, let's get started, guys. Oil will dry on my face. So this soap is a little bit harder. Oh, it smells so good. Robert asking me what I think of it and I told him I liked it but performance wise I get to use it now so it is harder but it does lather up very well very well look at that right off the bat huh Hope everyone's doing well. Like I said, it's been crazy. Did a lot of yard work today. Been out in the sun. I'm beat. But I am glad I'm doing this. Man, that really took off. Look at that. I got people upstairs trying to sleep. That's why I'm down in the downstairs bathroom. I don't have my usual setup. Which is alright. Oopsie. No big deal. Been attacking trees. Last couple of years, I always swear I'm going to start pruning and I end up getting distracted with other stuff and end up not pruning at all. So I was pruning today. Got my Fender handball mug, excuse me. So I was outside with my daughter, she was out playing in the hose, and then I got a big old plastic barrel, because I haven't set up the pool. So she was in this barrel with the hose. So funny. You get a little bit thicker. That's some really good soap. It smells really good out of the tub. It's very unique, very cologne-like. Give me a second and I'll read off the notes here. Wrote them down, there's a lot. Robert said there was a lot that he put into this. You can tell, man, it smells really good. I 
got a little surprise coming tomorrow. I get to uh, do a live shave with someone. I won't say who. But I'm excited about it. It'll be their first live shave. Sorry, I'm off the... <laughs> out of frame a second there. Oh, man. Man, this stuff smells so good. All right. My little Cape Cod guy. That was a wind chime one of my neighbors gave me. Her name was Lorraine. Is Lorraine. It was. I saw it. Asked her how much it was. She immediately gave it to me. Because she said she'd rather it stay in Cape Cod than sell it and it go somewhere else. So that's... I can't bring, to put it up, bring myself to put it outside and get ruined in the elements so it hangs up in the house. Um, all right. So we got top notes, nutmeg, orange, star anise, aldehydes. Whatever those are. Middle notes, carnation, jasmine, geranium, cinnamon, heliotrope, pimento. Base notes, ambergris, synthetic. Benzoin, cedar, vanilla, tonka bean, and musk. So what I get out of this instantly would be the vanilla, the cinnamon, Oddly enough, I personally, I don't get a lot of florals. I don't even get, I don't get the musk really. I definitely get the cinnamon and maybe a little bit of the tonka. I definitely get the vanilla and the cinnamon. Maybe it's some of the orange. I definitely get some of the orange. I don't get any of the florals that I think, that I notice anyways. But, oh well. Time to start shaving with this stuff. Goes on nicely. It is hard soap a little bit. Goes on very nice as you can see. Good cushion. Pretty slick. Not bad. Practical jokers on the TV, if y'all can hear the giggling and laughing. Sounds weird. So I got this tree out front that I've been dealing with. I don't know what kind of tree it is. It's humongous. It makes these berries that animals and birds love to drag all over the yard and bury in my flower bed so they start growing. And the weirdest thing is that the roots of this thing are crazy. They are long and they grow trees themselves. So I I found this root growing near my basement window. We have the uh, window wells where there's, you know, a basement window and then there's a semicircle and it's about 18 inches deep. And there's a root growing past one of those, like really close. So I'm like, yeah, that needs to go before it starts screwing up breaking into my windows, causing the basement to leak. So I cut the root in two places and left it there thinking it would rot. It sprouted a tree on either side where I cut it. Weirdest thing, man, look at the lather on this. I gotta show this. Like, look how much there is to spare. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. Mm. Get that orange now. I know this is a really weird setup. I'm not a fan of it myself. Everything's so close to me. That's 
that's all right. He has some releases coming. He has another one. I won't say the names of it. I know the names of his next two releases, but I won't. He probably don't want me to release those yet. But based on this, I'm going to be buying those. All goes well. It's great stuff, buddy. Let me show this again. Such good stuff. It goes on nice and thick the way I like it. I like thick lather like spackle. As I've said before. I'm not gonna do another pass. Tree's gonna be good for me. Alright. So good. Things in the wet shaving world are good. Picking up, got some good uh, summer scents. Um, wanted to tell Sean at Shelfer Shaves. Sheesh. <laughs> um, I want to tell him thank you. He sent me a care package today with like six Taconic Shave uh, samples in it. Um, Elysian soaps. Ten. That was dented. So he sent me that for free. I'll take that. I got to go on and get the splash now. OCD. But thank you, Sean. Really appreciate it, brother. Um, Dustin Wybrandt, you sent me um, Vanderhagen, the uh, Shea Butter Soap, not the Luxury. Is it the Luxury? I forget which one it is. The one that, that smells like powder. It's pink. The Puck. Very nice. Thanks, man. I really appreciate that. Um, let me go ahead and pause. Rinse this off. Get the splash going. I'll be right back, guys. Hey, real quick. I just rinsed it off. I haven't put the splash on yet, but like post shave of this stuff is really good, dude. I wanted to share that real quick before I dry it off. I was rinsing my face and I'm like, holy crap. Oh. And I am wearing the shirt that I use for my shave of the day. This is Arno from uh, Assassin's Creed. Copyright Ubisoft Montreal. Oh, that's good. All right, give me a sec. And I'm going to use the splash. Actually, why am I going to say, give me a sec and pause it? I was just about to pause it, which is weird because there's no reason to pause it. All right. Told you I'm tired. Sorry, guys. Well, this ain't the best review. That's all right. Just wanted to get it out there. So his splash is alcohol sda 408 100 proof alcohol fragrance polysorbate 80. i'm glad it's alcohol honestly oh. gonna suck for shipping for him international or he just might not do it internationally we'll see oh Oh, that splash is good, dude. Nice burn, but that smell is really good. Ooh, that's good. All right. Splash is phenomenal. Get the splash to go with the soap. That's good stuff. And the black. I specifically picked this. Aside from the fact that it looks awesome for the shave of the day photo, it actually does match up quite well with this soap without completely annihilating. Oh, 
Cine Profiles. Oh man, gotta trim the beard line, I think. Put it up a little more. Well, damn, gang. Some good soap. Burn the Ships by Hoffman. Hoffman Shave and Soap Co. He makes bar soap too. I think I'm going to delve into his other stuff too. This is really good. Wow, it's good. It's good. It's good. Liar, liar. Good movie. All right, guys. Really appreciate you watching. One of my shorter videos. Um, I'm going to be doing a live shave tomorrow. About 3 o'clock Eastern. Catch me there. Um, next shave I do, I'm going to either use Crown and Crane. I'm overdue for that. Sorry, Liz. Or I'm going to use um, Sugar Cane Beauty. The shave cream that Robin sent me from Sugar Cane Beauty, a company in Seattle that I recently discovered. So, appreciate you all watching. Go and get Burn the Ships. You won't regret it. Um, I would say it's spicy, teeny bit citrusy, um, definitely some vanilla to it, almost a cologne, but not quite, because if it were overly cologne, I wouldn't really care for it, because I'm not a huge cologne guy with soap anyway. It's like a natural cologne scent, if that makes sense. It, it's really damn good. I think I get a lot more of the florals out of the splash than I do the soap itself, if that helps. It's really good. And I believe Pete Hendricks assisted, yep, with the splash. So, there you go, guys. Appreciate y'all watching. I really do. Um, I will get back into the norm. I'm kind of out of, out of my comfort zone. I was really getting in to the videos and then things happen, you know. So I'll get back in it, I'll get my bathroom back and my setup. And uh, thanks for everyone who tuned in with the live with Tobin and I accidentally deleted the damn live. So I couldn't post it on YouTube, but as Tobin said, you live and you learn, right? So, all right guys, appreciate it. Thanks for watching. Till next shave, I will see you guys then. Take it easy. Happy shaving. Be safe. Happy summer.